The next day, the family gathered to welcome Buster home from the hospital. He's coming. What he's wearing is temporary. Please don't comment on it. Or salute him like that idiot guard down there did to him. Well, look who's back. Let's all say hello. Hello. Hi. And while you're at it, let's all give me a big hand. <laughs> George Michael, get your uncle a bandage for his forehead. Yeah, and while you're at it, uh, get two. Oh, my I guess God. this means you don't want to play gotcha nose with me. <laughs> oh, what's the matter, Buster? Did you hurt yourself? Uh, hi, John. Oh, my God. What, what happened here? He's got no hand. Buster went swimming in the ocean, and according to him, a seal with a bow tie bit off his hand. Bow tie? It's merely the playful mutterings of the shock victim. <laughs> a seal would never prey on a human, unless, of course, it had acquired a taste for mammal blood. Job had recently dressed a seal in a bow tie and used him in a magic trick. When it failed, he You're released the, the seal world. into the ocean. You're not going to be hand-fed anymore. I mean, how the hell would a seal know how to tie a bow tie anyway? I can barely tie the yellow one that I wear in my act. This one had a yellow bow tie. Really? And later, Lucille could not contain her guilt any longer. I didn't. I prayed that God take anything he wanted from us so that Buster wouldn't have to go to war. Oh, Mom, after all these years, God's not going to take a call from you. I did this. I think that the seal with the yellow bow tie might be the one that I release into the sea after giving it the taste for mammal blood. OK, you've got a better case than Mom does. Still, I could hunt down that seal. Well, they said if you retrieve Buster's hand, they might be able to do a transplant. At the very least, I could remove that incriminating bow tie.